All right. Um, talk to them. I hope they get the crowd they noise thing is really interesting. This is coming in today. The big uh, Pats Colts game was it was huge. Was huge on Sunday. It did an amazing rating. The, obviously, the Pats still undefeated. It was a great game. Blah blah blah. Well, a uh, little controversy. They're trying to figure out if uh, the Colts were uh, pumping in extra crowd noise in the stadium mm-hmm. to you know to try to you know mess up uh, the Pats. Obviously, because yeah. the Colts are at home. No, but CBS is saying that they they were pumping in the extra crowd noise to make it sound what more exciting so people will watch. Why was why was CBS pumping in crowd noise? They pump it into yeah. their telecast supposedly. Why? I guess well, to make it sound more exciting. That's not. I don't. I don't want that. <laughs> no. Well, what a laugh track. <laughs> what a laugh track here, like you're doing your sitcoms. <laughs> But the, the NFL looked into it, and they're satisfied that uh, the Colts didn't actually pump in extra crowd noise uh, in the stadium itself, and that this was a CBS issue where they just add crowd noise to make it more exciting uh. as you're watching from home. Yeah. I didn't realize they were doing this, but I guess this is a regular thing that they do with the football game. God, that that irritates me so much. Why? Well, how much do, how much entertain, like It's a production, you know? But how much stimulation do we need? Like, it's not enough to watch the game. We have to feel like the crowd is swelling. I don't care what the crowd I, is shooting themselves. You know what it is, too? It's so the annou- I think the, it gives the opportunity for the announcer to really, like, yell. Because if you hear him, he's like, and where there they are at the five yard line. Where yeah. And if the crowd was just kind of, uh, he'd, he'd be talking and it wouldn't be as exciting. Well, the, the, my, the, the crowd isn't mic'd well. Like, we have an example. We have uh, CBS here. Pumping in crowd noise for the big game that was this Sunday, and then the CD skips or whatever uh, they were using to pump in the crowd noise skips. You'll hear it go, yeah. And right after that, because they have to turn that off, you hear what the actual crowd sounds like. It'll it'll go by really fast for like a second, but listen closely. Yeah, it's a lot, and it's kind of pathetic because it was such an exciting game. But this is how how the crowd is picked up for the the broadcast if they're not pumping in extra noise. Mm -hmm. Listen, it's about like baseball: good pitching beats good hitting. And when you play defenses just, that are quality, like the Patriots and the Colts, hard to just put up. Hard to put up. Good. That sounds like an amazing crowd, right? Oh, huge. And that's right. That's a good point. Hard to put up. You can see him yeah. raising a little bit. Yeah, he's got to like sound. Yeah, because that... excited and loud. Because that's being pumped into his uh, his earpiece or whatever. Ugh, stupid jocks. Listen for when it skips. Good numbers, but there is some good hitting out there. Yeah, there's a lot of that going on. Most of it coming from this Colts defense. We start the fourth. Jim Nance with Bill Sims. The second and 11 for New England. And Moss open on the slant. Down to the Colts. See, that was the uh, the crowd. <laughs> the extra crowd CD or whatever. Uh, skipping. And then, listen, it's going to stop in a second here. Listen how lame the crowd actually is. And Moss open on the slant. Down to the Colts, 42. 13-10 games starting this final quarter. <laughs> There's nothing that sounded like a B. Right. Mm. That's and why. before that, it was... <sighs> That's why they do it, Jimmy. It's, it's annoying. They have to enhance it because the reality is from the, the, the broadcast booth... It's sound like, like a go- it would sound like golf. Yeah. Uh, we're here. The yeah. team is at the 40-yard line. I think that's kind of interesting. Let's go back to it. The second and 11 for New England. They're pumping that in. Listen to that. CD skips. And Moss open on the slant. Down to the Colts 42. 13 10 games starting this final quarter. <laughs> and it's just. And nothing. then he lowered his voice. Yeah. Then it, it was just nothing. Just another way of just making something phony. It's like, I don't need that when I watch football. I've never went like to watch a, a game and went, well, the crowd's not pepped up. I better go home. Yeah. I just watch it. When, crowd- when, when something is really happening and the crowd goes wild, that. Makes it that much better, you know. You ever see, uh, especially in baseball, when you know, th- it, you, you're talking like a clutch play, and the crowd is standing and going crazy. That's exciting. Yeah, and I think they're trying to f- fake that just to uh, get people uh, pumped up about the game. It's, it, Go ahead, Jimmy. No, I said what, what disgusts me about it is it's the same as a laugh track. It's gross. 
It is, we're going to tell you what the reaction should be. Mm -hmm. How about just allowing a natural reaction from whatever it is you're showing? Yeah. How about you don't put laugh tracks in sitcoms or, or crowd swelling noises? Let people just react how they're reacting. Mm -hmm. We don't need that to yeah. enjoy the game. We've had fun with that over the years where we play the laugh tracks oh. after really bad jokes. Not, I yeah, mean, yeah. I, I mean, actual TV shows, and you're like, why would a crowd laugh this hard over this dumb line? They wouldn't. Here's the official uh, explanation. Uh, the Colts contend the debate about the dec uh, decibel level in the RCA Dome is merely noise, and now they have the NFL taking their side. A day after some unusual sounds were heard during the Colts-Patriots broadcast, that's what we just played for you guys, the NFL issued a statement saying uh, what sounded like simulated uh, crowd noise was actually created by the CBS production crew, not the Colts. So that wasn't being heard in the stadium, just on the broadcast. CBS has informed us that the unusual audio moment heard by fans during the game was the result of tape feedback in the CBS production truck and was isolated to the CBS broadcast. It was in no way related to any sound within the stadium and could not be heard in the stadium itself. Mm -hmm. Oh, like what, the giant crowd swell couldn't be heard in the stadium? Then why are we hearing it at home? Yeah. Yeah, then why are we hearing it at home? Why don't you just, why don't you just dub over the referee when he's talking <laughs> and, and make him say funny things like America's funny song <laughs> video? Yeah, and put in sound effects like boing when <laughs> right. someone gets hit. God, it's just... It's just another way that Americans just just need things spoon fed to them. It's yeah. annoying. Bunch of dopes uh, need uh, hyper stimulation. This is a good. Uh, I remember this. Duncan, Rhode Island, go ahead. Hey, good morning, boys. Good morning. Uh, I don't know if you remember um, a couple years back, CBS got caught piping in uh, bird bird chirps on golf broadcasts as well. Yeah, that was a big story yeah. during golf. Uh, well, and That's good uh, Brian Regan bit too. <laughs> you know how they got caught? I'm so you watch. So that's not me, or he sued. Well. <laughs> It, it, <laughs> the, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> the golf. I didn't really need an answer. <laughs> I was just going for that up there, but I know. But oh, I could have used some crowd noise pumped in after my awful joke. <laughs> oh wait, hold on. Say it again, Jimmy. What? What? Had, had they noted the bird sue? <laughs> <laughs> wow, you're killing, Jimmy. You're killing on the show. I stand corrected. I like it. <laughs> See, that was funny too, Jimmy. Yeah. I bet the bird got a lawyer. Is that, is that being piped? It, oh, no. Jimmy, you phony. No. <laughs> People were really laughing, guys. I saw their faces. How they got caught. So they got bird noises during a golf uh, 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 telecast or whatever. Yeah. Right? Some bird enthusiast, like watching from some out-of-the-way place, recognized the bird sound and said that it's impossible that this bird actually lives in this location where the golf tournament was going on. Possible. And then all of a sudden went on his computer and started angrily typing, how dare you? He knew the bird call was not indigenous. Indigenous, that's what that, I was looking uh, for. Yeah, right. To that uh, golf course. Right, right. <laughs> Come on. Imagine, uh, we got the Brian Regan bit. We should play this going in. Imagine break. your whole thing is taken down by a bird enthusiast. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he kind of likes birds and golf. What a fun hang he must be. <laughs> When I was watching golf, I noticed my other hobby, bird enthusiasm. Mm. Yeah. Signed, T. Chiasano. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. That's right. <laughs> Tom likes birds and golf. Tom probably called in. Tom's, Tom's a different case, though. I mean, he's like a... Oh, <laughs> oh time to fall asleep, oh, everybody. No. Yes, Tom. <laughs> yes, Tom. Here's one of the issues with football. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is... They're, the companies are afraid to wire the crowds now. Those, they used to have these oh. mics sitting down in the crowd. So they would well. crowd noise Because they're worried about picking up ambient cursing. Oh. Well, you know something? That well, makes a lot more sense. I don't like it at all. I think it's stupid. But it makes at least it makes more sense. But so back in the like day, the crowd. not like they used to. You kind of would hear that. I kind of remember. Back in the day, it would be hilarious. And, and the, and the, the announcer would have to make like it didn't happen. That's true. Wow. Yeah, you don't hear that anymore. Okay, so... Uh, so every right. football game you uh, watch on TV, for the most part, that... Is it all piped in, then? Most of I it. No, I don't think so, but it's just... It's no, not, no, but a big percent, cause, uh, percentage, because we just heard what happens when the CD stopped, and it was it was very low it in, was the, like in the background. Right. Uh, most there. of the sounds you hear, uh, crowd-wise, when you watch a game, is pumped in now. All right, so, that, that but it makes sense. And uh, I do like birds, and I do like golf. I, I don't... I don't <laughs> birds, I, I enjoy more than golf. I just Why do you like them. birds? Yeah, they just kind of look at you. They, I, I don't they know. hate you. 
I don't know. Believe me, three thousand, three million, three thousand, three million years ago, they just would have pecked at your face. <laughs> right, eating not you. Nice. Right. Yeah. yeah. What's wrong with you, Tom? I Little dinosaurs in your house. <laughs> <laughs> so, would you recognize the uh, the uh, sound of a bird that wasn't indigenous to your golf course? No. Right, no. Good. Anytime you say there's hope for you, that indigenous. bird sound is not indigenous. With a gunshot should just be yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. Thank wow. you, sir. That's funny. That's how, that's how Thank they you, caught. Tom. So they had to fess up because of some nerd. Yeah. That they. Uh, I think Brian Regan talks about this in this bit. Uh, he's going to be part of the New York Comedy Festival that's starting up what, in a couple days. Tom notices people from uh, certain economic groups that aren't indigenous oh, to his golf boy, course. Does he? <laughs> Doesn't want to openly admit it, but he notices. Yeah, they, 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 it's right. It's like they pump in white people talking. So it doesn't sound like they mix. Just, you know, they drown out all those black and Spanish voices with a, hey, how are you? Good game. <laughs>